Another year, almost at a close, and it kind of feels like Groundhog Day, busy at work, busy in the street as people rush around, buying gadgets and cheap tat for people they like and people they don't. Personally, I can't complain, though. Roof over my head, food in my belly, money in my pocket. The wider world presents something of a more crappy picture, though. Brexit drags on next to a backdrop of bollocks. Yeah, self-proclaimed patriots trotting out the same tired shit, same knuckle-dragging appeals to the bigoted dipshit within. That UK politics has shifted in the last 18 months is obvious. I try to stay away from the daily barrage of so-called news, though I do dip in here and there, to stay in touch. The airbrushed version of reality being put over by the Conservatives is increasingly removed from reality. It's feelings over facts, I'm afraid. But it ain't just here where facts and common sense have been taking a beating. Donald Trump in his rookie year as master of the universe seems determined to fuck the world up more than it already is. I noticed today the Chileans have just re-elected a billionaire right-winger to the presidency. And Austria has put together a coalition of scum fuckery, including actual fascists. And the Islamic world is rallying together right now, as I speak, behind a common enemy, or enemies, should I say, namely Israel, And Mr. Trump. Yeah, a lot of shit going on. If you were a writer of shitty dystopian 80s or 90s movies, whatever, and you were projecting into the near future as you would have to do, wouldn't the world of 2017 be something you might have imagined, if you get what I'm saying? Civil wars in the Middle East... Tyrants abusing populations at home and playing mind games abroad. And large numbers of people not really caring about what's going on in the wider world because technology has enslaved them somehow. Yeah, but we're not living in a badly scripted car crash of a movie. You know what? Things aren't all bad. They could be much worse, if you think about it. Unlike some people, I don't believe self-destruction of the species is inevitable. World peace is a very difficult but achievable goal. As with other constructive, progressive projects, though, The thing is, some people you can't really work with. Maybe you can work around them. Or maybe you've got to get rid of them if you want a better future. Did that sound dark? It's true in any case. Right, no more videos until 2018. Yeah, so... I'll take this opportunity to wish you all a Merry Christmas and a decadent New Year. And I'll see you all in January. Bye-bye.